The project that we're currently working on is a dome projection for ScienceWorks. This will be a sort of component of a deep ocean exhibition, but it will showcase um, our local waters, it will showcase Port Phillip Bay. So the aim of this small exhibition, I guess, or this component of the exhibition, is our underwater backyard. It's to, it's to take people to these things. And the way that we're, we've envisaged it is we're actually going to project the footage inside a vertical dome. So people can stand in there and see the footage around them. we're here on this uh, windy Wednesday is that it's the week before the full moon in June and in this location in Port Phillip Bay it's a really good time to see spider crabs. Every year around this time in both in May and June hundreds of thousands of spider crabs migrate up out of the channels into these shallow waters to molt so it's their, their annual molting um, period and so we're hoping to get in and shoot some of this footage today for, uh, for Underwater Backyard at ScienceWorks. We're now in the second stage of underwater backyard and this week we're going to be diving with Melbourne University Department of Zoology. So we've got John O'Hearn uh, skipping a boat for us which is great. So this is going to allow us to get out to some of those sites that are a bit further offshore and hopefully it'll mean that we're a bit less weather dependent, we're a little less tide dependent. Let's go. So we're about 20 minutes out of Sorrento and we've arrived at our first dive site for the day. This is Pope's Eye. Originally it was going to be a fort that was built in the 1880s. So it got made into a marine sanctuary in about 1979. And what we're hoping to get here is the huge schools of beautiful fish that have made, made their home here. There's lots of wrasse and herring kail and old wives and scaly fins and it's just, it's a fish paradise. We've just finished at Pope's Eye, we've got some really good underwater footage there. The weather's been kind to us today so we're going to head east by about 10 or 15 minutes and check out a point called Chinaman's Hat which has some seals living on there so hopefully they'll jump in the water and we jump in the water and we'll get some good stuff over there. Thank you. 